Today I will try to explain making stock solutions from solids and let's get started. So our task is uh, for the following problems calculate the mass of solid needed to make the solution and then prepare the solution in virtual lab and uh, explain steps you took in making its solution and preparing it that has correct concentrations. So uh, we have 100 milliliter of solutions that's one uh, amine sodium cation and using sodium chloride and uh, I have some calculations right here so we know that uh, we can take the molar mass of uh, uh, elements from a uh, table and I did it and calculated and then we know that moles equal more T multiplied volume of solution and uh, as you see uh, we can take here our uh, volume of solution and molarity and I calculate moles and uh, we see that uh, for example we have natrium chloride we have uh, 5.844 gram and let's get started I prepared before starting the video some uh, stuffs for example I took one liter water and I will I'm gonna put right here as I said before uh, 5.844 let me check again yeah it's true and pour it and we see that we see that we have right here two point something uh, almost seven and I will drop some water on it and uh, let me make it 100 and uh, I think it's gonna be 3007 and uh, yep yep it will of course and mm -hmm and okay let me drop uh, a little bit more water probably i made a calculation mistake uh, so 0 0.312 uh, pour it okay and 0 0.4 okay i am fasting that's why maybe my brain does not working right now uh, okay uh, I'm gonna drop it uh, volumetric flax uh, to, to check that we have uh, exactly correct answer and our volumetric flax is 100 uh, milliliter and uh, we see that molarity is 1 and 1 okay uh, let me remove these ones and this one too this one too but I will keep the water and now I have take uh, magne magnesium chloride and uh, I will take some volumetric flax and again 0 0.1 volume and uh, then what we will need and okay let me take also one baker and uh, I'm gonna drop some magnesium chloride right here how many how much 6.665 okay 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 six point six six five yeah yeah and pour it and I'm gonna drop it one metric flax flask two point okay let me put it down here okay and I'm gonna drop
okay uh, let me drop 10 more okay let me take some some out of it uh, with pipeline pipit sorry uh, we will need this one okay Here we go. Okay. Uh, and we see that we have uh, 1.39 molarity and 0 0.69 uh, magnesium molarity. And let's m let me remove these ones too. And remove. Uh, remove. Where is that? Here it is. Remove. Okay and we we have uh, right here sodium sulfate uh, decay rate okay and uh, i'm gonna use we will need a uh, 0.25 volume baker and uh, let me put volumetric flux to the same volume and uh, i'm gonna drop how much 29 30 okay so i don't pour it and i'm gonna drop it right here okay and uh, I will drop some water too. Let me calculate it. No, not exact. Exactly. So 2.50 and 3 more 0 minus 18. Uh, nine, 7, 9, zero, 9. Okay. give me something different answer okay let me put seven more uh, 6.9 here we go and uh, let me see and our molarity is, is 0 0.68 and uh, 0 0.34 and uh, right here temperatures or something like that. and let me remove uh, not that one not baker and volumetric flag flask because uh, we are gonna use uh, 0 0.5 uh, liter uh, flax and let me take this one and uh, I will this time I will take 40 40 28 and I'm gonna drop it right here here we go okay let me try a little bit right here that's all and my computer is gonna be blow up okay uh, I'm gonna put some water too five more one more and zero point uh, eight nine, yeah, nine eight nine. Here we go. 
and we see that our molar is 0 0.5 and uh, for sodium 0 0.25 uh, I hope you enjoyed guys uh, thanks for watching uh, see you bye